Good evening, everybody. It's Tinsera, and we're getting ready for our Front Mission 3 story night. We're already on episode 15. And we've got a rather large uh, boss fight ahead of us. So, as my new tradition is going, we're going to start with some simulator battles to let uh, anybody who wants to catch that get into the room. I don't know. We'll do... Uh, I'll do Tell Base. I I'm not feeling strong enough yet. <laughs> uh, I haven't played it in a while. I'm afraid to do the other one. Every time I've done Fukushima, I, I don't do well. But it's okay. We, we could use a little more XP before we take on the... This next fight's going to be a little trying. So, because the ti Tiny? Tiny? I looked it up on Google, and I used Google Translate for Chinese to try and get a proper enunciation of that word. I was calling it, I think, Titanly, because I want to think of it as a Titan, and I think that was just my brain doing that, but it's Tiny, Tiny, I think, is how you say it. The fortress, the super fortress that we're going to go and take down, I hope. So I decided we'll get everybody a little bit more XP, and we'll check our items and our upgrades. Oops, I would help if I actually had the right overview. There we go. Now we're good. Apologies. I got carried away getting into the stream there, and I forgot to switch it out. I'm hoping to make a new starting screen. I've already passed the idea around in my Discord, which if anybody wants to join can actually do that now I get an invite up but I'm passing on the idea that I'm probably my thank you stream which I really really need to get to because everybody helped me get to affiliate I'd like to thank you guys so the thank you stream is probably going to be a just chat stream with some music and the paint program I use open and share factory and we're going to make the end credits and some emotes. And I'm going to let the viewers all contribute to that. And then I think there'll be a giveaway. Oh, look at this. We get to start the match with it. I love this. I love when a double salt. Yes, Fruity, you're in true fashion today. Knock him out. One hit. Bam. Not much XP, though, because we only got a body. But that'll work. Hello, Radiation. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're just in time for mechs blowing up. It's great fun. <laughs> it's great. I love it. I love it when I can start a mission and the first thing I go after, it's gone. Uh, you didn't miss any story. We're just doing some simulator fights to get ready for it. Oh, you redeemed it. Right off the bat. How did you know? that I was just drinking coffee still and probably dehydrating myself even more. But I, I've got water. I have water. I don't know if you can hear it. I have water. It's in my, uh, my work coffee cup. Actually, it's filled with water, and the big mug next to me is my coffee. Yes. Basically. For all intents and purposes, when that's redeemed, I have to drink. I believe I have some of a, a limit on it. I hope I do, because otherwise everybody's just going to say, keep drinking. <laughs> I, I have a lot of hilarious rewards down there. Also, Radiation, I don't know if you were in the stream. We have a community um, contribution that you can throw points into. Throw as much as you like. But if the community fills that bar up, um, the community is going to pick my next storyline after we beat this. They, they can pick any game at all. The description's in there, I think, if you look at the reward description. You don't have to claim it. You can just read it. Come on, do your worst. And then he ejects me. Watch. Ugh. Didn't eject me again. Get in there, Marcus. Mix it up. Teach this guy a lesson. And then he gets ejected as well. No, no, no. Okay, we're good. Boom! 
Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna have to do another simulator battle because we're about to clean house. Jeez, the luck I'm getting. I just blew all my luck though. Now watch. I'm gonna start the storyline and we're gonna just get trounced. Ooh, ready to fire up on a shotgun. Ooh. Ow. <laughs> do it again. <laughs> Look, they're just answering to my command. Oh my gosh. What is it with my team today that they just all decide all of a sudden we're gonna... Lord. Oh man. That's a great way to start a simulator fight. Maybe a little too good. <laughs> I was expecting a little challenge here. Okay, we didn't like get a double assault. This is like magic card that forces someone to get get a coke. Yes, like the uh, like the old magic cards that were a joke. <laughs> Any game is a bit too loose considering some of the filth available on Steam. Well, uh. I have it in the description, I thought, but it's also on the Discord. It has to be a PG title. It can't be an M-rated game. And it has to be a clear game for... It has to go past TOS. So. It can be any game that is allowed on Twitch to be streamed, and it has to be teen or lower. So it's not really any game. There's, there's a stipulation there. My channel is not 18+. plus. Mine, mine's is safe for work. Oh, there was a helicopter back here. Yeah, you're next. I do not like helicopters. One shot at a helicopter. Next. Good, I'm glad you thought that one out. Yes. No, I, I knew that would be troublesome if I guaranteed I'd pick any game. And then I, I know for a fact somebody... I don't think any of my friends would, because they all know my stance on games, but I could just see somebody in the chat recommending that I play an M-rated M game on my channel that's full of cursing and blood and everything else. No. No, no, no. There's, there's a bit of a parameter that we have to follow. You know, I really don't need to do this to this guy, but I need the XP, so why not? Oh gosh! That's, this is overkill. Well, well. That's, that's one really, really pinned down mech. He's done. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Can't really do anything with him at the moment. It's all shotgun team here. This was an experimental team we were using. Um, last mission, I think. He's stunned, so we go after him. Boom. He gone. He done. Yeah, all shotgun teams, not bad. Uh, you can get into some trouble with this, but... This is, uh... No, it's a pretty good team, though. I don't think that tank's gonna last. Toy cars don't last very long. Nah. Toy car gonna get it. Bam. I got for Saga Frontier 2. Oh, are you recommending your vote for it is going to be Saga Frontier 2? I would love to play Saga Frontier 1, 2, or 3. Any of them. But uh, since you put that up as your category, I'll start looking for it just to see. Because I'm pretty sure I still have it on the PlayStation. I just have to go back and look. It would be a good choice, though. I would like that. I wouldn't mind narrating it. Yeah, that went so quick. We're going to do another one, I think. 
Yeah, not even like a 10 minute battle. Uh, while we're out here, we'll look at the items and stuff too to make sure that we're fully upgraded for the boss fight. Because I, st look at this, uh, Mark V E-Pack, I think that's the best I can get. Yeah, the other one's weaker, so. Just leave that alone. We have the Com 6, which I think is the best I can get for quite a while. Hmm. Oh, I've got the activate. Ah, some of these are really good, but I, I just want more skills. I don't know if... Eh, that's not... I think we'll ignore that for right now. Oh, Lenny. We has a Lenny. This machine needs a name. I got another punch bot that we can name. Or I put him in a different punch bot. I have a couple already named. <clears throat> I'm going to change my vote. I have to figure out a game that is difficult and wordy. Great. <laughs> you do that, Radiation. You do that. Of course you would. I would not put it past you to find something that was difficult and wordy for me to do. It's fine. You know, I need... Um, Emma's machine was the one that we were looking at because it didn't have the good fist. And I was trying to figure out where we'd get the weight. And I'm wondering if we should get rid of the item backpack on her and just make her another super mech. I'm really big on carrying around items, but at the same token, if we put the other backpack on, what can we do with that? Let's go buy one. I think I have enough. Yeah, I've got 2,600. Let's, let's see. We'll get a 30 additional power. I think I have the best shotgun. We have a new flamethrower activated that we could buy. Yeah, we're still in the same shotgun, so that's not going to do us any good there. But, and we have a heavy spike, but I think that one's outdated now. Yeah, it is. It's completely outdated. Ooh, this is going to be risky in that fight because I'm not going to have... Uh, oh, yeah, I'm going to be missing a lot of items if we do this, so... Who can I turn into a hill bot? I think Dennis is in a hill bot. He may not even have a backpack now that I'm thinking. No, he does have the E uh, backpack. Uh, let's see. So one of them will have to be a hill person. Probably Dennis, I'm thinking. But I have to pick a really good machine for this or build a new one. So what do you guys think? Do I build a new one, maybe? Yeah, I got all that taken care of radiation earlier. Were the... Did they do the results? I don't know. Let's see. I have to figure out one of these guys... We did capture... These were the um, imaginary numbers. Fanzers. Maybe one of them is really good for a hill bot.
Oh, it's not until tonight? Alright, I'll have to make sure I watch that. I'm sure I can catch it on, uh... Well, it might be on Twitch, I don't know. I'll, I'll look it up. What's his weight like? If anyone on chat wants to help design it, just put it up there. I welcome any backseating or any information if people have good ideas. I like to use them. Because right now we're just trying to make somebody who can carry around a lot of repairs. But still contribute something to the team. That has capacity four. Capacity four. Oof, we don't have a lot of choices. Well, you know what? We'll buy this. And the body's not bad. I have remaining weights 166, but it's not going to be that good after we get weapons on it. Hello, Praxian. Welcome to the stream. We're, we're designing a Hillbot before we get started with the story, because this is going to be a pretty trying battle. Distraction card effects? Oh, like, do you mean like double shields? <laughs> it wouldn't contribute too much, but I could, I could make a sponge. What's a lightweight weapon that we can use? So it can do some damage, but still have a shield and items. Probably something long range, right? Not missiles. I don't. I don't want missiles for this. I mean, I have basically. It looks like I can buy every kind of weapon. The sniper rifle. Uh, machine guns are good mid-range, and it's, well, it's a little heavier than the sniper rifle. Well, we'll do a couple battles. We can get some more money if this doesn't work out. I'm thinking that we should have a shield, because this is a heal bot, so it needs to run around with something that can protect itself stay in the fight the longest without needing to absorb all the hills. Oh, we come really close to almost getting a missile on here, don't we? <gasps> oh, that's interesting. We could actually have a missile launcher and... A sniper. The missile wouldn't do much, but... I have... See, this is why I saved that quill from earlier and I didn't sell it. Okay, and then we would just throw a whole bunch of repairs in there. I think I actually have a lot of repairs. That we could, yeah, I don't need to buy any. Save some money. So, we've got a mech with... I don't think its arms are going to be very good. The arm that'll matter will be the... Um, the shield. We gotta get its hit points up. That's probably... 276? Eh, that's not too bad, I guess, for basic arms. What do I have in my... We, we captured so many mechs. We've probably got lots of arms that are better. 276. Uh, the castle's arms are really good. Ooh, what is this Wood 3? It's got 500. That would make that shield arm really good. Uh, that might be upgraded, though. That's probably why. I'm looking at base. I need base XPs. Base, base hit points. Castle 2. You know, the Taidong does have really good arms. I might use a Tidong arm on that. But if the other one's upgraded, it saves us money. So let me go back to that. And then the left arm needs accuracy. 14. Hmm, 14 looks to be the best accuracy. 
that we're going to get. It's on the power paw. Ooh, low hit points, but we can upgrade it. How are those legs? 432. Move 2. So it can't move very far. That's not good for a hill bot. The weight's going to be bad if we do the other. Move 3. Move 6. Ah, it looks like that's probably going to end up being as close as we can get without downgrading our shield. Okay. Or, do I want to give up some on that, the hit points there? How many hit, how much weight do we need to get back? Well, I'll just go through here and see what's positive gain. Ah, there's nothing. Oh, here we go. Because we only need to get back about four or five hit point or weight I wanted to have better accuracy but we might be able to find a split between the two the old drake arm might work I have a couple of those though so let's not buy that drake 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 okay it must be I must still have it in use guess we will have to buy it Can I get something now with movement? This is the question. Oh no. I wanted the six movement. Okay, we're gonna have to settle for the Zenoslev legs. They're not bad though, I like Zenoslev legs. Okay, what do you guys think? Is this good? I think this looks like a little stout hillbot. Hmm. Now, who goes in the hillbot? Probably Dennis. I think he'll be the best setup for. Uh, what was that? The meeting? Okay, so Dennis is in this. I think his computer is upgraded. Yep. Upgraded computer. We've got all zooms, rate of fire up, and pilot damage. I think these are a good stack up. Although we could probably get rid of... Actually, no. This is a good stack up. That works really well. Well, now comes the fun part. I know there's probably most people are probably lurking but I'll just put it up in the chat too I'll sit there for a minute let's see if anybody has a good idea or wants to name it I actually have that as a reward claim if anybody's interested if not I can always go through my list. I have many friends to name machines after. I think I got 12 characters I can use, pretty sure. Because <clears throat> we've got, I got a lot of my friends are already named in here, so I've got to see if there's anybody else who wants to name it. Let me think, let me think. Commando short sight. <laughs> I might I might accept that. I don't know. This playthrough we were trying to get all of the uh streamer peeps in here. Or just anyone in general that's on Twitch. That is funny though, Commando Short Sighted. <laughs> That would be a good one for Lenny, because Lenny's kind of, in my opinion, he's a bit of a short-sighted fool. I know uh, Fruity just loved 
him, and he used them all the way to the end of the game. I might hit a little lag here. I'm opening up my other window because I'm looking at all my friends. I'm going to find somebody who we can... Uh, <gasps> uh, I would name it after Sleepy Fox, but Sleepy Fox L is so peaceful. I don't think she would want to be named after a murderous mech, even though it's a hillbot. So technically, technically... <laughs> It wouldn't be such a bad thing, right? Ah, uh, Ghost Panda has one. <gasps> you know what? Angry Barman doesn't have one yet. Hold on, let me come back and look at the chat real quick. Make sure nobody else has come up with a better name. Praxin, you want in? Okay, we can do that. <clears throat> yeah, if it's I want it on followers and Twitch streamers. That's what I was kind of the theme that we were following for the entire stream. We've been like the whole all the episodes. It's always been streamers and stuff that I've put in. And, and people who are following or in the community. Or community recommendations. Alrighty. What colors that we don't have yet? It's a hillbot. I don't think I have a mech that's all <clears throat> white. Or was Emma's all white? I think Emma's is all white. Sand yellow. That might work. Red brown. Yeah, I think Emma's was all white. She's like a white knight thing that I've got going on. Bright red. I've already got a bright red. I think that's Choose Mech. Oh, I kind of like the green. Okay, let's go, um, we'll have to upgrade it. You like that look? There you go. Let's at least get it some hit points. I, we'll have to farm a battle to get enough. Episode 15 is basically, because I think that fight is really long. So, the this episode is basically the fight. And everything we're doing to prep for it. Or what we can do to prep for it. Oh yeah, nothing's upgraded. We're, we can only get the body upgrade. Oh, I'm so not going to have any cash for all this. Can I at least get the boost upgrade so that we can boost? Yeah, there we go. I had enough for the boost. <sighs> okay, so... You redeemed cool face. Here you go. Where's where's cool face? I'll put him right up on here. If you want, I can put him like right over top of my face. Like right there. <laughs> it just uh, just hide my avatar. That would be really funny too, because then uh Ferdy will walk in and be like, what in God's name is happening? Okay, it's 528, you get him for five minutes. My ears will probably be peeking out. But you did the redeem, so you get it. You spent those points. It's all yours. It's going to be a gif eventually that will play over and over. Hi, Woody. Welcome to the stream. Is this after the last stream? Yes. We're, we're gearing up for the last, uh, or not last, this is a big boss fight where we're going to fight that tight Tain Lee, the fortress. And that was right at the end of the other battle. We had just gone back to Galzan and we're gearing up to fight the, the super fortress and bring it low. So. 
And and the cool face over my um, avatar is because Praxian redeemed cool face. <laughs> I'll I'll probably move it in a minute. I just thought it was kind of funny. I put him right over there. We'll move it next to me. How about that? But yes, Woody, you didn't miss anything. We're going to do a simulator to test our new hill bot. Did you prepare all the mechs? Yeah, that's what we're working on. Woody, if you've got any good information about the battle, share it, please. Because that's what we're doing. We're... Oops, I picked the wrong team. Um, right now, we're gearing up for a boss fight, so... And that's... I think you're right. I think that is a split fight, so... Let's see... We have a new hill bot who's going to be in testing here. Which is going to be um, Dennis. Nobody's going to need Hild right off the bat. Here we go. So we'll start in the engagement. Get some high ground. It's a sniper. I don't know how well this thing's going to do, but we got to get XP on it. Ah, we missed. It's going to be hard to catch it up, I think. But, you know, it was just something to contribute to the fight, so if it doesn't do well, it's alright. It's just, we needed somebody to have hills. But if we're going to be split in half, we may have to do two hillbots. Or two hillers. That first battle, we cleaned up. Nothing stood a chance to us. And Emma has a new spike, so that should help us. <clears throat> Ooh, he missed. Good. It's a miss fest. Punchy, punchy. Nope. Marcus is a better aim. <laughs> oh, you! Look at that. He's off the map. I gotta drag him back. Ugh. Luckily, they seem intent on fighting him, so we'll drag them back. Hmm. That was curious how they... He flew off the map. Now I gotta go this way. But yeah, we're working on preparing the mechs. We need a little bit more money to get upgrades on the Hillbot. Which is now named Praxian, actually, so I can quit calling it Hillbot. It's the Praxian model. Eh, not enough to one-shot him. We're getting to that point, though, with shotguns that we can take down the lower tier mechs. I should be able to... Okay, worse come, worse serve. We have six missiles to defeat that guy if he doesn't come back down. Ooh, I'd really like it if Dennis got in here and got the kill, because that's a lot of XP. Oh well, still some XP. That guy's toast, so we're gonna go down here and pick on the toy car. With double punch, so it's really not gonna survive that, I don't think. Oh, good lord. Just 26, 26 hit points. So close. And he's gotta use his missile launcher, even though the enemy is so far away. Okay, cool face timer, it just goes off. 
Thank you for the, the cool face, Praxian. I like it when everybody... I love those uh, redemptions. I have so fun, like, creating them. I don't think I'll hit this, by the way. But we're going to try it anyway. Little toy cars. How dare you attack Fruity Spruce. The group's not doing too bad, so I think we'll be alright. Oh, look at that. He only had to move two spaces. I don't know why they want the Zenislav dead. I think it's because... Well, no, I don't get it. Normally they target the healers, so I'm shocked that they're targeting the Zenislav. He's not going to give up, so we're just going to go over here and start picking on this helicopter. Uh, that's as close as I can get to it. Why not? We'll get up on the roof. Goodbye. Probably should have left it for Dennis. Praxian's machine has to get some points. It doesn't matter, though. We just really we need money. It's just got to survive the fight. Ah, there we go. We still get a kill. The accuracy upgrades on the equipment should be enough to offset that Dennis hasn't used that in a while, I think. Uh, Marcus, you're pretty useless except for soaking. And the helicopter was kind of cheeky. He went all the way off the map. But I'll make sure I make two saves before we do the fight. Just in case. Might have to reload because I don't remember. So I will caution that that, that battle may start in a reload if it's worse than I think it is. Because I don't want to spend the whole stream grinding. I'd like to at least get the boss fight in. Thankfully, we do have the quill, so we can reach that off-map guy. About the one thing they're good for. Eh, but we missed, though. I'd like to get that helicopter back down here so we can quickly end this. He doesn't want to comply, though. Oh, Lord, now they're both going off the map. Well. Isn't that something? And then we've only got one guy that can really damage them. Hopefully he can get zoom. No. Alright, that one's down. And since they're so intent on getting him, maybe they'll come after him. Let's see. Aha, you had to move. <laughs> I don't know why they wanted him so bad. The whole mission, they've just been like, nope, gotta get the Zenislav. That's okay. Because he messed up. Let's see if we can take him out with a sniper first, and then we'll try the other. No, oh, miss. All right, Zenislav, you're up. This guy wanted a piece of you the whole match. He'll pay for that. Finally. I hope I get good money for that. 
Mooney's credits. 620 is not really enough to do the upgrades we needed. Might have to sell some stuff. <laughs> I don't know. I'll let uh, I'll let the channel vote on it. If we do another fight, or should I attempt it? Yeah, I kind of wanted to build. That's such a good idea. What he said of. Uh, for more money, you can give Kazuki a uh, Taidong 3 Vanzer or just the arms. Activate the eject skill so you can capture more Vanzers. Yeah. And radiation confirmed just to farm the mechs. The, the problem is, is that I didn't... I've been trying not to do a lot of grinding on this file. And I haven't been able to trigger the skill. So I'm just trying to push the story. Um, today's episode's a little different because of the fact that it's a major boss battle that we're going into. I was actually just about to give you guys the option to vote whether I farm a little bit more in the story. I can't capture them in um, the simulator. As far as I know, you don't get the, the mechs there, so. Me finish this. Okay, so I'm gonna put up a little poll for three minutes. Anyone can vote, and it's anonymous, so like, you it doesn't tell me if you voted it or not. <clears throat> in case there's people who are lurking, didn't want to do anything in chat, but you can help out by guiding guiding the stream what we're gonna do next. Why look over the equipment? Well, cast your vote, Radiation. You were just talking about voting. There's a vote. <laughs> I do have some money, so while you guys are voting, I'm going to go and try and look at our Hillbot. Because I do have to do that. There's no way we'll survive with no hit point upgrades. Oh, they're so expensive. Ow. Yeah, I think we're just going to have to sell off some parts. I'll just make a machine here real quick and we'll sell it. Should be able to get a little bit of my... Oh, that's the police mech. I never did get to use this. What else do we have a lot laying around? Oh, I still have a bunch of these. They're junk. What else? What else? I, that's the only hover legs I have, but I'm not really keen on those. I don't really use them. I got plenty of these. And weapons? We don't have a whole lot of weapons. I don't want to sell any weapons off. Alright. The new machine is how much? 917? That's not bad. That'll give us a little bit more. Praxian's machine. That one already had a little bit of an upgrade. And just enough to get the health on the legs. So I think we have full health upgrades. Don't have any accuracy though. Hmm. Let's look at the poll, see how the poll's going. Uh-oh, I got two on grind more. It's only, what, a minute left? Not even? 
couple more seconds, guys, to, to cast your vote. Got three now. Uh-oh. So one person doesn't know which to do. It's almost done. Okay, grind more one. So we're definitely going to do another mission. I go with what you guys say. I've been allowing, uh, or trying to my best to allow you guys to guide the story. So you're saying that we need a little bit more training. Hopefully we don't get helicopters this time. Maybe we'll do a Fukushima run too. Um, I voted twice today. Oh no. <laughs> you need to grind more. My namesake Fanzer needs to be Banff. Um, what he says, I can sell the parts that are available in the shop. Yeah, I, I just threw them together on a mech to make it less selling, you know, of the parts. Hiya, Willis. Welcome to the stream. You're in time. We didn't do the boss fight yet. We're grinding towards it. We're, the, the chat just voted that they want me to get stronger before the boss fight. But welcome, welcome. Pull up a seat, get a drink, get snacks. Go to lurk if you want, it's fine. <laughs> Whatever you want to do. Or if you wish to participate and guide the stream and help out, also welcome to. I'm not gonna worry about the protections. We just need XPs, lots of it. But yeah, we're about to do a, a fairly... <clears throat> I mean, it's been a long time since I've done the Tai Ling fight, but I'm pretty sure that's a major milestone in the game, and it's one of the first truly tough... Maybe the second tough fight, because the first time you encounter imaginary numbers is a bit crazy, but it's up there with it. Try to let Dennis take down everything so we get XP. Let's see who is next on the list. Uh, do I want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this thing? Yeah, I guess we have to. Oh, that was actually a good choice then, because we got double assault. I'm going to try to weaken up a couple of these guys and run Dennis around to shoot them. Oh, he doesn't have to run around. He can just stand right here. All right, we got pilot damage. Maybe we'll get a chain. Oh, well, that was a pretty solid hit. I don't like the missile launcher, so I definitely got to take him down. Hello, Fruity. Welcome. <gasps> The Lenny! The Lenny! Look, Fruity, I also have... I'm gonna make it... I'll make it free later, but... We got Lenny! And we got Cool Face. <laughs> oh, sleepy day! It's, it's very dreary here and very cold. It's only 8 degrees Celsius. Uh, about 44 degrees, I think. 45 degrees outside. <laughs> We're having a freeze warning. The temperature just plummeted. I mean, I like cold air, so I'm not, you know, it's not problematic to me, but... It was a bit of a shocker when I went outside. And I was like, wow, it got cold quick. Oops. I was gonna save that for Dennis. Oh, well. This guy is running away from Emma. Like, no, I don't want any of that. It's probably why. I'll put Dennis up high. How about that? Body shot. Yes. Oh, I was hoping to kill it. It did not. Right. 
Guess get Marcus out here, because he's going to have to take on these guys. Or at least stop them. Uh, you have the same weather there, Willis? Yeah, it's it's cold here. That's right, you're up on the East Coast too. Yeah, it's cold and rainy and wet. It dried up a little bit, and then it's I think it's raining again. It's cold and dark and miserable here, and I've been sleeping in like one and two hour bursts. Aw, oh, Fruity, you should go go lay down, friend. Take a nap. Well, Praxium, we live here, but I sh I'm streaming to people all over. Celsius is used more <laughs> places. So I'm trying to get better with announcing things in both. If I tell the temperature. Hmm, punch bot. You gotta go. You're up there near our hill bot. Yeah, punch bot can't stay up here all by itself. We'll cripple him a little bit and then see if the other character can get the kill. Probably not. Oh, probably shouldn't have moved that far away, but... Ooh, we still got a destruction. That's good. Well, you had your chance to come after me, mister. And he did not. So you deserve that. No more missiles. Hi, Blowed Apart. Welcome to the stream. Is Marcus doing it good? Yes. Marcus is doing it really good. At the beginning of the stream, he one-shot the very first mech he got in front of. It was just done. It, it didn't even stand a chance. We're grinding up a little bit before the last boss fight to get you caught up, Blowed Apart. Marcus doing really good. Uh oh. Punch bot. That's gonna hurt. I really don't wanna shield it though, because I need to get more XP. Ah. Nice, not as cool as best boy Lenny, but close. <laughs> he's he's not quite as eccentric, but I, I'm having a newfound respect. For Marcus. I didn't use him a whole lot when I first played these games, so it's interesting to see what he can do. And since the Great Fruity has already claimed Linny as his own, it was probably useful to go with Marcus this round. Bye, Punchbot. Speaking of which, if you guys want to... He still has his VODs up for most. Some of them, I think. But Fruity also plays a lot of classics. He beat this game. There's a really good clip on his channel of the last boss fight and what a punch bot can do to a end boss. <laughs> uh, Lenny kind of wrecks it. Get him! Get him, get him, get him. That's really good XP. Really good. Yeah, tear him up. I don't care if he's surrendered. Keep going. Perfect. We're still going to pick on that, by the way. It's free XP. <laughs> I don't think you get as much, but you still get XP. Yeah, I still love that clip. I love that we got a clip of that last fight and Lenny was just tearing limb from limb off of those mechs. I don't know how he was doing it, but he did it. He was a good boy in that match. That was also a really solid win to that uh, storyline.
Why not? It's in my way. These mechs like to hide behind boxes. How dare you? It's not fair. It's probably a total waste of ammunition in real life, but hey. Uh... Oh, that's right. He doesn't even have to go near that guy. You like missile launchers? Here, you can have one. There's an election today. I gotta go vote. Yes, yeah, election day. I hope we'll be back in time for the stream. I'm, I might still be on, and if not, voting's more important. So head out, do your, your civic duty, and vote. Good luck to you, blown apart. Hopefully the lines aren't too long and you can get through it. Oh, and be, and be safe. I don't know if where you're at, they're still doing the masks and stuff, but just be on the lookout and be safe. But yeah, we'll probably still be going. And if not, there's always a video and I try to upload them to YouTube. I've been bad about that though, I'll admit it. I've been really bad. Uh, Fruity, then that means he can't vote. They're all evil and crazy. It's just a varying degrees. <laughs> I kid. <laughs> uh, you just you just go and you do the best that you can. It is a civic duty, though. So applauds to Blown Apart for doing doing what he's got to do. Oh, good lord, Marcus. Marcus is like, do not strike me. Do not touch me. Don't want to be touched. Punch bot, go. Oh, this is a punch bot. This is a missile bot. All right, you want to slug it out? Let's slug it out. I couldn't have planned that better. <laughs> That's perfect. Somebody else could get the XP. Uh, let's see. Okay, we're definitely not going to be able to one-shot that, so let's just go after the punch bot here. See you later, blown apart. Good luck. Sinuslub <sighs> doesn't need XP, so... Don't give up, don't give up. I need the XP. I need the XP, so don't give up. Ooh, ooh, that was so good. That's XP. Alright, got a little bit more money there. Might, might, we're getting there. I don't want to, I don't want the whole stream to be this. Let me see, we've already been an hour. Battles can take a while in this. I'm not really sure how long the boss fight will take, but I do know it's next. Let's see. Praxine, do you get any more upgrades? All right, we got defense upgrades. Uh, left arm doesn't need anything. I don't think it was the... I thought it told me what the arm was. All right, level two accuracy. I don't think we need it for that, but we'll take it. Evasion. Level one, we'd still have to earn a little bit of money to get the next... We need one more fight. All right, let's do one more. I didn't figure I'd get much done in this stream except for the boss fight, so that's okay. Do you think Taipei... I, th I don't remember which of these rewards better. I think this one does. Let's go here. New terrain. New scenery. A fresh level. I can't remember if this one rewards better or not.
and that's probably the team we're gonna go with. Maybe. We might have to restart if we find out the team's too split up. Yeah, see, I just don't have all the upgrades. I, I think so, Fruity. It seems to be that way in this game, so hopefully that's true, because I, I need Moonies. I don't really need the other. I need Moonies. Oh, you blasted helicopters. You're first. I don't like, I don't like the helicopters. They just run away. I make sure to take them out quick. This should be a fairly quick fight. Yeah, it could be a really quick fight if we're going to open up like that. I wonder if she can get two. Nah, I was really hoping we'd get two. That'd be fun. We're getting good damage, though. Punch bot, punch bot. I'm the better punch bot because I have double punch. Legs are gone. Arm is gone. <laughs> oh, sorry, I just smile so big when that happens. It's just like boom. <laughs> Stuff just goes flying everywhere. Hmm. New appreciation for the punch bot. Oh, almost got that. At least we hit it. Oh, it's really going to come after me, huh? Well, we're going to lose that, so it's just spiking. Goodbye. <laughs> He's still going to punch at me. Okay. And then he ejects me. <laughs> that would be great. No, he didn't do it. Uh. Uh. Marcus. Beast. Oh, Morgan and Fruity, thank you for the contributions. Oh, you guys are going to get there, like, pretty fast. To the community goal. I think M Morgan's lurking, so thank you for the lurk, Morgan, and just stopping in and saying, or contributing your, your bits. But I know that's basically saying hi, so. <laughs> I just saw that. I looked up. I was like, oh, yay, community contribution. You guys are... You're sometimes sneaky. You guys are sometimes sneaky. It's okay. Radiation is always sneaky. So if you see him in the chat, he's always a sneak. That's why in the Discord he has a special title that only he gets. He's probably going to surrender this one. No? I mean, it's fine. Maybe Dennis can take him out. That would be nice. He needs the XP. Bye, helicopter. Oh, more! More gears being thrown into the pile. Thank you, radiation. Looks like we're going to be smelting those gears into a new game. You guys are probably going to make it. Be able to choose what you want. Everybody better be thinking about what they want. And if anybody has questions, it's just, uh, you guys can pick any game. Doesn't necessarily need to be something I own. I'll pick it up. But it has to be, um, it can't be rated any higher than team. And it has to be stream safe. So it has to follow the Twitch's, uh, guidelines for stream safe. It's a very small list of games you can't stream. And most of those, of course, are, like, NA18 or something. But, I just wanted to make mention, it's not any game. Uh, it has to fit my channel. So as long as it's a teen or lower preferably game, or at least stream friendly, I will pick it up and we'll play it, and that'll be the next storyline game. 
probably take the place of front mission. Or front mission might move to a new day while I... I, I want to do Emma's or ugh, Alyssa's. So we're definitely going to do Alyssa's campaign. But that one's going to be really quick because we're going to have all the skills that we earned in this mission. In this story. So it'll be a, like a powerhouse drive through it. Kind of a speed run? Kind of. Not really though. I'm not going to... Uh, overwork my hands for it. No counter. I don't have a shield on that one. That's right. Ooh, ow. I wondered when this was going to happen because they always get an eject. Like, every, every other mission you're going to have a pilot knocked out, it seems. No worries. We got shotgunners coming up. That's the bane of the helicopter in this. I don't need to be accurate. I can just fire into the sky with a shotgun. That's crazy, because we even had anti-fire and I still got knocked out. Here you got Praxian, you should be able to get him. Not quite, but it was XP. Hopefully this is the money to get that last upgrade. Then we'll take a short break, and then we'll try. We're going to make our first attempt at the boss. Tree's probably in the way, but might get hit and taken down. So. Uh, Marcus can't do much but tank. I don't know, can we snipe it? We did get a zoom. Ah, oh, that would have been a nice takedown. Yeah, see, even he knows who the true threat is. It's like shotguns. Those are the bane of my existence. Oh, I can't reach him with that one, though. Money's... Okay, there we go. Another battle cleared. Let's see if we get better money from this. I, I mean, I don't think we need anything more after... Uh, no, that was worse. It's because of all the toy cars we had to blow up. <sighs> 390, is that enough to even get the last upgrade? There's just not enough mechs on that one, I guess. Is the Hillbot upgraded? I can either get Boost 2 or Evasion 2. I don't think I've got enough for either. Well, the Evasion upgrade's probably the stronger of the two options. Nope, we had enough. We're just completely broke. Yeah, we did it. We actually got it. Okay, Willis, no problem. You go do your human stuff. I know how that is. A lot of the time when I'm watching streams, I have like a million things going on, so. I appreciate the lurk. I appreciate coming in and saying hi. Have a wonderful lurk. We're going to go on a little break, too, so hopefully you'll be able to at least glance in and see the boss fight. Because I'm going to take a little break here. All right, so we're about to do the boss fight. 
Oops. I think from now on I am going to start typing up some things so that when people, because I know um, you might have the tab muted, which is completely fine, but then that way I can notify people when I have to get used to that. That's a good idea, actually. I was interrupting myself, but I, th I do that all the time. Yeah, if people are on a tab muter or have the stream muted, this way at least if they look in, they'll know what's happening next. All right, guys, everybody get some popcorn or drinks or snacks. Go to the restroom because up next, we're going to see if we can't take down the tiling. I hope. Let's see if our little band of rogues can do it. Okay, hopefully everybody got up, stretched, and had a break. That's what I did. Got a feeling this kind of be a tense battle unless I get super lucky. I am thinking, hopefully Praxine won't get too upset. But I am thinking that I would like... There's just something about the rifles that bothers me. And I kind of want to see if we can get the weight back down. I only get one weight back from that. Might have to take a weaker machine gun, but I'd kind of rather have the solid damage from a machine gun. And a lighter shield. Let's just try something real quick, just to see. If we don't like it, we can go back. Uh, maybe not. I just, we're not gonna have the weight, not with the missile launcher. Q. 
Can we get something now? Oh, there's nothing there. Might have to buy something? What kind of machine gun? Well, the condo's like a basic one. That's really weak. That wouldn't even be worth taking, probably, at this tier. Could do a shotgun, but that's... Hmm. What would I have to sell? Hmm. The best machine gun that we have is this. We definitely have the weight for it. We just don't have the money. Parts. Guess we're going to have to sell some stuff. Oh. Oh, well, that gave me enough money. Should be able to buy another one of these good machine guns. And the weight's good, so we should be able to... Should. Keyword, should. Be able to get that other shield that we bought. I think I can keep that on. I don't know, what do you guys think? That should work, right? Hello, Buno. Sorry, I wasn't looking over. I got distracted. And you went to lurk. That's fine. Thank you for joining the stream. Maybe you'll find the, uh, you poke in and see the boss fight. That's what we're getting ready to do. That's why it's taking so long to gear up. But enjoy your lurk. Let's see. Alright, I think Praxine's about as good as we're going to get it. It's fully upgraded. It has a lot of items. It's got a shield. It has a machine gun. Alright, everything looks good here. Let's make a save. And we're going to go to the boss fight. I hope. Because I'm pretty sure it's like right after that. Because the end of the last stream, I think we talked to everyone already. In case something bad happens, let's make two separate saves. Not over top of our previous save. I think that's the smart thing to do, just in case um, the game glitches or something. I would not want to go back through place. I mean, I'd do it if I had to off stream, but boy, would that take a lot. All right, let's move to the dormitory. I believe that's what we had to do next because they're like making their plans. <clears throat> Where's my coffee? Oh Lord, it's the whole team. Who do I talk to first? Everyone's in here. I say we go backwards. We'll talk to Jose first and then go to Emma. Jose, let's hope luck is on our side. I hope so. Lenny, what do you got to say? I can't believe you came all the way here with us. Everyone, I don't know what's going on, but as long as I'm here, let's go. You've been working hard for us lately, Yoon. Can I get a raise? That's beside the point. Hey! We'll pay you when everything's done. I'm gonna hold you to it. She probably will. Thanks for sticking with us, Marcus. You certainly kept me busy. I appreciate your help. It's alright. More stories to tell my family. I see. I like Marcus. He's a pretty good guy. Cool face. Let's see what he has to say. We've been with you since Japan. What? It seems so long ago. Why so emotional? You sound like Lukov. Let's just prevent the DHC from building Midas for themselves. 
Indeed, the entire original of it. Uh-oh. Raga. Kazuki. What? Don't you miss Japanese food? <laughs> Are you more concerned about food than your own life? Eh, you know me. Me and, uh, uh, or rather I should say, Radiation and I, in real life, that's how we grew up. We were basically Kazuki and Ryogo. Emma, we're almost there. Alyssa's waiting for us beyond Tylene. Tylee, the Tylee. I know, don't get too impatient, Emma. Let's try to stay calm. Yes. Okay. So we got all the little story out. I guess I didn't have to do that, but that was fun. Everybody's gotten, like, super hyped for it. I guess that's what that was doing. Out. Oh, no. I had to hit move, didn't I? Yeah, I don't think you have to go anywhere for food or anything. Oh, we did have to back out. That's fine. All right, so he said good timing. What is it? Commander, Quang is ready. Hong, okay, let's get started. What's going on? Quang is giving, going to give a speech. A speech? Yes, to encourage all of our allies. Hong, once morale is high, we take Tai Li, and we head straight to Shanghai. So, things are moving along. Quang, are you ready? Yes. Marcus, pretty full scale. This speech gets broadcast to all of our branches. Let's start. Quang. Hello, everyone. I'm Quang, the son of Ming Hong Yu. As you know, my father was working to bring democracy to this country. He was assassinated by our current chairman. Ji Bao Lao. I want to continue my father's legacy. I'm not well spoken like my father, but I need your help. Let's change this country together. Wow, well, looks good. Kazuki, yeah, this is great. Hong, some of our squads are already on the move. Yes, they're heading towards Chongyang. Chongyang? Tai Li is passing through Chongyang tomorrow. We can't miss the opportunity. Is Quang going? Yes. That's what did you want us to do? Come with our squad to Chang Yang. We need to leave right away. Get ready. Oh, see, it's a good thing we did that because it just gives us an option to go or not. Ready, I think. <laughs> Tell our forces we're heading out to Chang Yang. Move out. Autobots, assemble. <laughs> I just saw the whole thing from Transformers in my head. Autobots, assemble and roll out. Should have named one Optimus Prime. Ooh, ooh, we're somewhere else now. Rebo oh, this guy. He's a meanie. Ravani Embassy Office. Chairman G. Bal. What's going on with Midas? Bal. We have one of those scientists in custody. The other will be captured soon. The original Midas is lost, but we can have them build another. Then my country will rule the world. Bal. What about you? I hear Ming's son is still alive. It doesn't matter. We have Tenley and Rapid Reaction Force. Once the imaginary numbers go into mass production, our military will be invincible. That'll cost quite a bit. I'll give you all the assistance you need. I hope to continue this relationship. I'm heading back to, to command the mission. Don't let me down, Ball. Lukov, what's happening with the mayor? Lukov, we tried to capture her, but we failed. Failed? That doesn't sound like you. 
I'm sorry. Bah, if you can't capture her, kill her. Luca, there's no need to worry. As long as we have a list, she'll come to us. Bow, sisterly love, eh? What a joke. Evil people. Kazuki, tell us about the mission. Hello? Tenley's size limits its routes. Anyone else getting the, um, I gotta pause. Anyone else <laughs> getting that Star Wars vibe when they were going over the Death Star? <laughs> and they bring up the little three-dimensional model and they're going over how they're going to go down the trench and, you know, blow up the Death Star in Star Wars. I don't know. I'm getting that vibe. Hello, Maremi! Maremi, welcome to the stream. You're just in time. We're getting ready to go and blow up a boss. I think. I think. And that's that's the story, actually. We, we spent the entire first hour grinding. <laughs> And trying our best to prepare uh, for the boss fight. And I was just telling everybody, I feel like this is like that Star Wars, uh, the, is it the first one? Like right before they go after the Death Star. There may be a lot of explosions. Might be me exploding. Dennis, Tin Lee can't move. And we can lure out the Vanzers with decoy. I see. Oh, the place is surrounded by cliffs. We'll destroy one of them close to close off Tenley's path. Then we destroy rapid reaction force outside and infiltrate Tenley. That's well, what would you have us do? Hung, you'll play a key part in the mission. Rago, meaning we need you to infiltrate Tenley and destroy the engine. Yun. Are you sending us to die? Hung, I have confidence in your skills. Our squad will be the decoy. Marcus, oh, how do we get in? Zun, take a look at this. Oh gosh, it is like Star Wars. We're gonna have the little three-dimensional layout, aren't we? Yep. <laughs> On cue. This is the mobile fortress, Ten Lee. Enter through here. Okay, we gotta go up an elevator. The deck elevator. Here's a quick outline of the interior. Enough jibber jabber. Just tell us how to take out the dang thing. It's most effective to destroy the power supply. As I said before, attacking the exterior is useless. However, just shooting up everything inside will accomplish nothing. Put the fortress out of action. Destroy the power plant. Yeah, okay, it is like Star Wars. We gotta go to all the way to the center of this thing. <laughs> is it that easy to infiltrate? The rapid reaction force and the imaginary number force are the first wave. The direct attacks will come from the cannons. That's way too hard. The rapid reaction force is also inside. Are you serious? We should divide our forces. Right. One squad will destroy the rapid reaction force and the imaginary number force. And the other will infiltrate Ten Lee. We should pick a leader for each group. How about Kazuki and Dennis? Dennis's annihilation squad and Kazuki's infiltration squad? How's that? That's fine. I'm okay with that too. Okay, so Cool Face, Cool Face gets his own, um, his own squad. How should we design this, folks? Because I, I forgot that this was two teams. I thought it was just they split my normal force of four or five guys. Cool Face is leading the Annihilation Squad. Let's see. <laughs> Mayor Emmy, now when you see, uh, when, when you hear us making jokes about Cool Face and people calling me Cool Face, you understand who it is. <laughs> it's Dennis. Our whole group has a thing about Dennis. 
Okay. So Dennis's squad, Dennis himself is in... Yeah, now you know. And knowing is half the battle. To quote G.I. Joe's. Boy, you can tell what I grew up watching. Okay, so Dennis is in a hillbot. <laughs> Thanks, Joes. Now you know, and knowing is half the battle. I, I, I think I learned a lot of my childhood lessons from uh, Duke. <laughs> from G.I. Joes. I bet you most people blew off those little PSAs, and I was, like, enthralled by them. I was glued to the television when Duke came on to tell me something important. This is study hard. <laughs> Morgan. Morgan says, the more you know, because knowledge is power, and power corrupts. So study hard and be evil. This has been a PSA from your friendly Morgan. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks, Morgan. <laughs> oh, why do I not have the quote thing up? I need to fix it so I can get quotes. I gotta keep that. Morgan, just so you know, I'm cutting that. Please, please let me do this without crashing OBS. I'll just open the first document I can find. Oh no, Morgan, you're going to get credit for that as soon as I, uh... I just haven't figured out how to add quotes to the channel yet under, um, stream elements? Okay, I have it in a text document. So when I get quotes up and running, I'll be... That's going to go in there. I, I love that. It's totally going to be a quote for this. This channel needed that. That was good. Oh, thank you. That made my day. That was definitely put a smile on my face. This is funny. Yeah, I got to figure out how to do it. I'm not really sure. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm blithering. And we have to put together Annihilation Squad. Cool Face Squad is Cool Face. He's a Hillbot, so we don't need another Hillbot. We're going to take Marcus for heavy damage and tanking. Ryogo for ranged assistance. Hmm. Now who? I need somebody who can run back and forth with items, though. Oh, no, we... I have to save Sam Killjoy's um, bot for... I need another healer. All right, we'll take another solid DD for this group. Okay. Yeah, because I think Sam Killjoy is the only one that has items in this group. Oh no, I need to change that mech. That's not a good mech. Why is it not, not letting me... Am I missing something? I thought I could change the mech here. <clears throat> Alright, I think you can do it before the battle. So... I don't know, guys. I think this is going to work. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sam's in the game. We've been naming the mechs after all of our friends. See? Praxian's in my channel as a follower. Uh, a subscriber, actually. One of my founding subscribers. Ghost Panda has a really evil machine, believe it or not. Little, little Ghost Panda has one of the best machines. <laughs> Lasana VT is another uh, VTuber I follow. Just Catlin has one. Uh, Sam Killjoy. Uh, Morgan's mech is the punch bot, like the main punch bot for our team. Oh no, I have to remember what I did here. That, there we go. Uh, Fruity Spruce is in the Zenislev, which is an all-rounder. And Linny will be in something, I really hope. We're going to have to go back if I can't change that, because that machine has no upgrades. 
Operator, Commander, please get ready. Tenley is approaching. I must stay behind. Good luck, everyone. I'll navigate for you guys from here. We're counting on you. Good luck, everyone. Let's go. Oh, thank God. We would have been so... Thank God they gave me this. I was getting really worried. Yeah, but uh, here you go, Emily. Emmy. Sorry. We have all the people. I've... Ah, oh, that's who we need. Lenny. Lenny will go into Haichu's machine. That was a good, good machine. I do like that one, so we'll take that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Mayor Emmy. Mayor Emmy. We'll make a save here, just in case something goes horribly wrong. Which might. Just fair warning to everyone, I may have to reload this. I forgot this is a... I knew it was a difficult fight, but it's even more difficult than I thought it was. Because we have to use pilots that aren't upgraded. Alright, let's see if we can do it. You just had a bolt right in your chair, because I... <laughs> Sorry. Uh... I've had stuff like that happen. Well, just in this morning's stream, oh, I was like three seconds away from taking a drink of coffee and someone played the goat noise. And I'm so glad that I did not drink the coffee because I was about to like spit it all over my screen. So yeah, I love it when little things like that happen and make you jump. <laughs> it was It was bad timing. I'll note this weakness for the next time we have to burn cats. <laughs> Congratulations, Blowed Apart, and welcome back. I hope that all went well for you and it didn't take long. Hung. Okay, let's do it. Just as a side note, I really like those clouds. I know it's just like a two-dimensional with pixels, but I really like the way those clouds look. Hung Long Soldier. We're ready on our side. Ah, oh, we're gonna totally trap them in there. Come on, this can't fail. We're just blowing up two mountains. Yeah, I know they're... This is a really old game, by the way, Emmy. It's, like, from 1999. So. But those are gorgeous clouds. Good lord, look how big this thing is. I'm in love with it. Anyone who knows me, by the way, knows I love big, mechanized things, so. I'd be a horrible ruler of a country. I'd probably want to build nothing but big machines that do things. Probably to no one else but me right now, I'm in awe of that. It's amazing. It's like an aircraft carrier for Vanzers. Boss, is this... I had an idea, but... Who would have thought? What do we do? This is no time to be intimidated. Let's do it. Yeah, trap it. It's almost a shame to blow it up. I wish we could capture it. Now, blow it. Did we get it? I think we did. I do think in reality this would probably crush that machine, depending on its structural integrity, or would cause massive damage to the internals. With modern engineering, uh, the vibrations alone would be knocking paneling loose, pipes would be falling everywhere.
But I do love it. I love that design. Oh, gosh. I'm strange. There's something about big, large vehicles that just triggers me. Hence why I use gears as my symbol. I like tinkering with machinery. Did we do it? I think we did. They're stuck for sure. Blown apart. <laughs> the RRF is coming. Right. On schedule. Draw them further out and destroy them. Dennis, the rest is up to you. Marcus, you're going to be pulling your weight and then some, bud. Dennis, it's my turn from here. Stay sharp, people. Jared, we meet again. Resveda, this is the last time we deal with such pathetic life forms. Imaginary numbers. Resveda, destroy the enemies. Yes. Let's end this annoyance once and for all. <laughs> I get it. I see what you did there. <laughs> I see what you did there. I need that as a uh, alert. Oh boy, Morgan, you're also your your vehicle is going to be heavily relied upon in this. So I hope Punchbot is up to the challenge. I think we're going to go anti-penetration because I think they use all rifles in this. Missiles for him because he's going to stay back. So he'll get pelted with missiles more than likely. Okay, where's the Punchbot? Got to go. I got to make sure he's way up front. Oh, he didn't give me the best angles on the camera, guys, but I'll try. I think those guns can fire on us, so I'm going to go with anti-penetration. Ryogo is probably going to be the second best damage dealer we have, so I'm going to throw him there. We'll have Yoon bring up the back end there, and Dennis in the middle. Punch by Ooh, <laughs> ooh, 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 punch by. Oh, I was right. Good thing we did this. <laughs> Those guns are not just for looks. They're active. Oh, my. Uh, I think we're poorly equipped for this fight. They have a whole division of punch bots. And I can't even get up to the ramp yet. Can't hit the stationary guns there, so let's back down. I want to check it from here. I'm going to go after that first. Until we can get everybody up here to support. Good miss. It's a rifle. Hmm. Can he hit it from back here? It'd be really nice if we could hit it from down here so we could finish it in one go. Not even a chance. Not even a 1% chance. They really didn't want you to get that. Maybe. Okay, there we go. That was... Whew. At least we got something down in the beginning to even the odds up a bit. I wasn't sure we were going to make that work. Oh, that's right. She doesn't have a lot of AP. She's one of my untrained bots. Hmm. All right, Marcus. Get up here and start doing your thing. Yeah, cool face is in Praxian's machine. You'll see his face on the thing. Uh, Dennis is back here right now and he's the one that made the kill on that turret sorry 
Yes, cool face broke a thing. Let's see if Marcus can break a thing. If he doesn't get ejected by this guy's skills. Alright, that hurt. But he did get double, double punch. Go Morgan. The Dark Knight did some damage. I don't mind telling you guys, this is tense for me because this could go horribly wrong really quick depending on who they pick on and how many lucky hits they get. If anyone gets ejected from their mech, I'm done. Okay. Morgan's, Morgan's playing tough here. Oh yeah, punchy punch. You just knocked out a imaginary number in one go. Punch, 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 punch. Oh, uh, what's he hitting me with? Is he, he's really good at attack. Okay, so he's truly a punch bot. Well, we'll go first. Let's see if we could stop it. Hmm, I was hoping for like a stun or something, but that didn't work. Probably should have shielded that. Punch bot versus punch bot. Ooh, he does have the upgraded spikes. <clears throat> I'm not going to be able to heal him either. Hmm, this is going to be problematic. I can't get to him unless we take out someone. Lowest in health. Well, this guy's going to surrender. Ah, this is... Hmm tough choices here to make. We'll leave Dennis to last since he's got the healing equipment. That guy's out anyway, I think. Alright, there's a surrender. Can I retreat him back? I really don't want to retreat back, but we've got to get a hill in. This thing could probably do him in in one more hit. I don't want to attack out of fear of uh, retaliation, so we're going to leave him there for a minute. Kind of regroup. I got to keep that punch bot alive. He's pretty much our main source of damage at this point. Eh, not the greatest turn, but... <clears throat> yeah, Morgan's Morgan's tearing it up for us. We gotta keep him alive. He's kind of the main hitty unit in this. Oh, Morgan, you figured it out? If you need to edit it? Ah. Well, yeah, after stream, I'm going to totally look at adding that. I want it so bad. I keep coming up with things I'd like to put it, remember. Oh, it's added? Fruity, did you do it? Can the mods do it? Good. The mods can do it. You just saved me a heck of a lot of time. Uh, Defend this or not? Yeah, shield. Just in case. Yeah, it did land. We're just going to eat that with the shield. <gasps> Fruity! Thank you! Morgan and Fruity, thank you! Amazing! <laughs> it's the first quote for the channel, and I love it. <laughs> it's awesome. Uh, win or lose now, I'm, I'm good. That just completed my day. Ow. This guy is hurting me. At least it's like in a kung fu movie and they're not all deciding to come at me at once. It's like, they're, you know, they're waiting on the outside. <laughs> <gasps> oh. 
Morgan's going super beast. Oh my gosh. I said that and look. Two of them in a row chained. Goodbye, imaginary number. It's already active. Oh, neat. See, I didn't even know it was already active. Shows you how much I know. Again, knowing is half the battle. Morgan, you just wiped out another imaginary number. That's 2-0 for you. Good lord. He's hurt. He's a bit wounded. We, we planned for this, though, so... We knew the battle on this side would mostly be a war of attrition and taking down punch bots. So we we planned ahead. Hopefully we can trap and lock these guys off from one another so they can't heal or support them. No. And you guys, I know you see me not attacking, but um, we got a lot of punch bots. I can still do damage on retaliation, and they're going to just keep hitting me. And the more chances I give them to hit me, the more we're going to burn through repairs. I knew this was going to be a battle attrition, just cycling through repairs constantly. Ryogo's the other one we have to keep alive. The other two really don't have the skills to help out here. Although, I might be able to get that guy's arm off. He's anti, uh, penit or not anti pen Oh, so close. I'm just debating whether I really want to hit him right now. Yeah, do it. We've still got a couple more hills. I got rid of the arm that was retaliating, so that's good. Punch Uwu! <laughs> front, front mission. Uwu edition. <laughs> First one was kind of squishy, but the second one was built for brawling. Yeah. <laughs> Could you see a super cute version of this game with like rainbows flying everywhere and all the mechs are multicolor? Yeah, front mission. Front mission three. It's in my brain right now. <laughs> it's... Marami is having a... Uwu. Uwu edition is playing in her head. Shield up. Ooh, ow. Okay, we stopped the damage, but that's... That's not good. If we deploy back here, though, only that should be able to hit him. He's still gonna fight me? Oh, oh, you deserve this. Go, Morgan. Is Morgan gonna get a third? Uh, yeah, Morgan's getting a third. He is hungry. My goodness. Good Lord. Look at this. I'm just leaving him there for a minute. You guys, like, he gets his kill animation. Three. Three and oh. Yeah, that's the only thing I can do. I'm gonna lose something. I might lose this mech. Yoon has to fall back. Wait. Uh, let's see, Ryogo, you're gonna go in. What do they have? Spikes. Okay, so they have spikes. Gun. Spikes. Okay, anti-penetration um, it is. We had it anyway, but I was just double-checking. That that's what we needed. I've got another repair to slap in there. She can fall back.
the war of attrition. I was just going to say, don't hit the arms, please. I need double punch all the time. Ah, right, here comes the missiles. I, I know. I was going to say, your, your back's sore, dude. They're, you're doing a lot of carrying for the team. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. I knew I'd heavily rely on Punchy Bot. Oh, that little sniper. Not as worried about him as I am Jared. Jared has skills. Enter the second punch bot. They don't do much to shields though, so it's okay. Especially when you have the appropriate stuff turned on. <clears throat> Ryogo's arm is almost gone. Oh, that's a shield arm. Hmm. I think his repair is going to be better used here. We gotta get Jared out of here. He hits way too hard with skills. Chain it. Thank you. Hydrate and stretch. Good idea. I'm going to get carried away with this and not remember to do either. And I'm stretching while we're getting something done anyway because we got a Zoom fest. Go cool face. All right. I'm stretching. I know it doesn't show it on the model yet. Wait until I get full body. It's coming. I promise. I'm actually already in talks with someone to buy a VR set, so. And I have my water. Ah. Are you talking about Jared's fruity? Because, yeah, he has amazing uh, defense capability. That's why we were trying to soften it up before... Oh, never mind. I think we got Jared pegged at this point. I don't think he can do anything. I, I'm i pretty sure even if I miss most of this, he's gone. That was a good go on uh, Cool Face. Oh, would you look at that? I said that, and he gets to attack back. Ugh. All right. Come on, Morgan. Body hit. I swear I'm not using any mods. I'm on Vita TV. I can't mod this. I swear. Welcome back, Willis. You're you're in time. We're still in the fight. It's tense, but we're winning. I think. I think we're winning. Morgan is now 4 and 0 on That's 4, isn't it? Yeah, Morgan's model is now 4 and 0 on imaginary number kills. Falcon Punch! Yeah, that was actually... <laughs> That's great. Yes, he has single-handedly dropped four of the most elite mechs in the game. I will admit the others are supporting him. They're healing him. Gotta keep him alive. Oh, ow! That hurt. I think that was the shield arm, though, so that's not too horrible. got this last punch bot who's probably going to take Yoon down, but eh, there's not much I can do about it. She's cornered. Hmm. Yeah, and I can't get to heal it. I'd like not to take this out so we can capture it, but I might have to. Rosetta here is also pretty bad. She's got 10% uh, evade. Spikes, that's the only weapon she has, but she is an ace pilot.
shove the spike <laughs> right into the exhaust port. Well, you might have to, Morgan, because I got to get around this somehow. Actually, I'm going to skip her for a moment. And I'll tell you why. Unless, oh, he didn't get ejected good. I was going to say, this guy's really weak to melee. I'd rather just get rid of him. And you're doing just that. This could be your next kill. All right, not quite a kill, but way more than I thought we'd get. All right, okay. I choose mech got one. I think it's High Choose Mech. No, no, that's Lasana's mech. It got one. So Lasana's mech's up. But it did what we needed, which was to save uh, High Choose Mech here. Oh, no, we have a tr tough choice, though. Oh, okay, never mind. Morgan's okay. I think we were right with the other one. I don't want to shoot that. It'll just retaliate. This can retaliate too, but I'm hoping it misses. <sighs> no, wasn't that fortunate. Ooh. I have a restore low, but I don't want to use it yet. They got incredibly lucky on this round. Ow. I think that mech's going to end up going down. Let's see. Ryogo can't do anything unless he repairs himself. Dennis is still okay. He's just been healing for the most part in this mission. I think I got an idea. It's risky, but it should work. He's not quite trapped in, but I don't think he can get around. Oh, he got an initiative. Ugh, those skills. Yeah, poor Liz. Hey, she took down something before that happened, so it's alright. See how the AI responds to my weird strategy? It's still going to go for her? Okay, but it's really hard to hit somebody in melee with a, on foot. It was better than having the mech killed. Yeah. I was kind of hoping that that was the scenario we were looking at. Because what we can do now is, I hope... is now box dude face in if it all works right. I don't have any more items, right? No more items here either. I really don't want to box it in then. I guess I should try and drag it around. I was hoping to box this thing in. Yeah, we're going to have to at some point anyway. It just keeps getting initiative. Come on, Dennis. you got to prove yourself here. We need lots of chaining. Oh, 
Okay, that was pretty good. No chain, but we got a stun. Free attack. Don't hit the arm, hit the body. <sighs> okay, that's fine. At least I can survive that. She's still stunned. It's stuck. Oh, okay. Now we might have this mech. Yeah, that was a big stun, Fruity. That's, this was a... Uh, what do they call that? Cinching... I don't know. Clutch. That's the word I was thinking of. This, that was totally clutch. I needed that bad. Question is, will it be enough? Probably not to kill it, but we even the odds on it. That thing was at full health. Or, or, Morgan, Super Beast? Yeah, pretty close. I think we got rid of the main arm. Now if it hits the body, it might take me out. Close, Morgan. You're really, really close to doing it. Oh, Lasana just got another one. Oh, Lasana took down two of them? Oh, good. We didn't have to kill the missiles. <gasps> oh, God. <laughs> I did it. Yeah, it did kind of look like it just got, sh you know, ragdolled off the platform. <laughs> Uh, not bad. Gold rank. And we got, we got money. I'm, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll keep it. Morgan just went berserk. Holy smoke. Four. Morgan had four and Liss had two. And I think Dennis, uh, in the beginning got one of the launchers down. Kazuki, here comes the real thing. Oh, I was breathing a sigh of relief, and I totally forgot this goes right into the next one, doesn't it? Okay. Dennis. Kazuki, don't overdo it. Kazuki, don't worry. Now we're going in. Yeah, you're going to have to tell Liz about that. Or, or get a clip and show it to her. <laughs> look, Liz, look what you did. I could just see Liz right now cheering. <laughs> Jumping up and down. Yeah! I took out two of them. Hello, Buno. Welcome back. I think you were lurking. I can't remember. But either way, welcome back. Lovely to have you here. At least it gave us a place to save. Speaking of which, I really don't want to like stop, but I want to see... Oh, I'm already at 2 hours and 11. But everything's going really well. I wonder if I should keep going. I normally don't stream past two hours for these because I upload them to YouTube and I try to keep them within a about two and a half hour time frame. Yeah, you guys just... Um, I know she doesn't know anything about the game, but you guys just mopped up what was probably left of imaginary numbers. <laughs> so that, that was a big bad guy fight. <gasps> we can Uber some items. I know, Mary. I mean, there was just Morgan went to town. He was just knocking arms off left and right. Oh yeah, and Mary, I mean, this is what we call Ubering. We we order Uber for missiles and upgrades and items. <laughs> Don't ask. It just is, and it just works. I don't think we're going to need Dennis again, but we'll go ahead and reload him. In other words, I forget anyway. 
Because, uh, I mean, we blew all the items in that. Okay, we didn't blow all of them. Yoon still had some if we needed them. The next team... Uh, thank you for the follow, Critical Twins. Hope you're enjoying the content. Welcome to the channel. We're enjoying Front Mission 3. We just got done a spectacular boss fight. Morgan's mech carried us through that pretty, pretty well. Uh, Critical Twins, hello there. I saw from Lissa's Discord that you were streaming Front Mission. <laughs> People play Front Mission still. <laughs> well, welcome, yes. Uh, I think Fruity and myself are the only two who still do Front Mission. But... Oh, and I kind of, I feel bad, by the way. I meant to do this when you guys came in. I always forget. And I'm going to do one for Fruity. Because he's my pal when it comes to uh, the classic titles. If a meteor hits the stream, it's all over. <laughs> oh, and let's get Buno one too. I got like everybody's in here while well, we're stopped. We're doing like a shout out session real quick. I should have given all of you guys like shout outs. Oh, we did it twice. Buno, you're, you got two. <laughs> Good job, Fruity. Beat me to it. But yeah, Critical, uh, or I'm, was it Critical? Yes, Critical Twins. We play Front Mission. I play Final Fantasy Tactics. We just started Legend of Dragoon. Uh, on the future is... Vagrant Story is on the list of things to do. Oh, you like Armored Core. Oh, Critical. My friend. I'm going to have to friend you, I think. <laughs> I ask everybody in this room. They all know. I, I am... I swoon when I see big vehicles and mechs. Like, a good time to me is is going up to Norfolk and just staring at the boats. <laughs> I consider that fun. I like to go to tank museums. I can spend an hour reading about two different tanks in one museum. I've done it. I've gone to places just to look at them. That's all. I go to jet jet uh museums. I go on museum ships. <laughs> I really enjoy mechanical things. Which tanks? Uh, mostly here in America, we get to see like the models of the Shermans. And uh, there's a couple Panzers. There's one Panzer I haven't gotten to go see. It's, uh, I think, I want to say it's in Richmond. It's, it has the Derp Cannon. I need to go there because it has the 10.5 centimeter cannon. And I didn't even know a model of that existed still, much less that it's here in Virginia. So I need to go down there some point and see it. Oh, that's, believe me, critical. I want so badly to see the North Carolina. Yeah, that's on my list of things to do. It's a bucket list thing. I want to tour all the ships again. And I've never been on the North Carolina. I want to go. <clears throat> museums are the best, Mayor Emmy. I love museums. I know a lot of people these days just like... it's. Most of my friends would call it boring. But to me, I love, love museums. The, the Shermans are pretty cool. I have some choice words for Shermans. But the modified Shermans that the soldiers did on the field are amazing. Uh, yes, Morgan, yes. I'm just nodding with big eyes, yes. I have their DVDs. I, I watch them all the time. Girls and Panzers. I do like Girls and Panzers. Oh boy, chat, like, hold on. 
Sorry guys that I've paused this, but the chat just went zoomies. To, to quote Cyril's chat. The other day, Cyril's chat, oh my god. It, it, I can't remember which one said it was zoomies. Was it Fizzgig? One of them said zoomies, chat zoomies, and it's stuck with me. And I think Cyril's using it now in her quotes. It's just amazing. <laughs> chat zoomies. Mayor Emmy, you were there, I think. I'm pretty sure you were you were partaking in the chat zoomies that day. <laughs> I went to see the USS Lexington. Oh, you were actually on the aircraft carrier, the Lexington? Awesome. That is a beautiful ship. I've, I haven't been on it. I've seen it. I've gone up to it. I haven't been in the... I need to take a tour. Museums are so much fun. Yes, Willis. I... I don't know why, I just have a blast going in there. <clears throat> Back in 2016, went to uh, Aviation Museum. Oh yeah! Are you talking, there's one in the Smithsonian's I think, but um, if you've been to DC here in our country, the Smithsonian's are like a big collection of museums and they have an aviation. Redeem the hydrate, yes. Uh, that's actually a good idea, because I'm doing nothing but talking, and I haven't drank anything in a while. Might be out of water. No, but that was the last in that bottle. Ah, uh, thank you. Much appreciate the hydrate. Oh, yeah. That's great. I'm I'm glad that all of you guys like museums. It seems everybody here has kind of a, a passion for that. So I I deeply encourage you if you don't have a passion to go to a museum. Find find your passion and find something that relates to it and then look it up and see if there's a museum for it cuz more than likely whatever your passion is, like if you've got a hobby, there's probably a museum, and I highly recommend supporting local museums because most of them are run on donations. And it's very hard for them to maintain the, the museums. I donate to a couple tank museums for that reason because it's a lot of money to keep those tanks in running condition. Uh, Emmy, me too. Maybe we should just do a group trip because I want to go there because they have Tiger 101. And I have to go see the last remaining Tiger tank. It's it's on my bucket list. I got to see that thing before it breaks down. <laughs> the one, the only... Uh, if I don't know if you guys know anything about the Tiger, but you might. Because if you've seen any World War II movie, it's German's like super machine that actually made it off the blueprints into war it's a box tank uh, big 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 gun on it so you probably saw the tiger tank and didn't know you'd seen it but yeah the last remaining one on earth that runs and is fully functional and has a working gun exists in the UK uh, the British Tank Museum still has one and they run it once a year they bring it out and run it around Stretching, I am stretching. <clears throat> that would be uh, uh, quite the uh, trip. But I would love to go over there because then I could visit Fruity. Depending on how close he is to the museum. I actually have a couple UK friends I'd have to go see. Subawu is over there. Thank you for the contribution. Your gears are piling up. Oh, it's, it's completely on the wrong end of the country. Oh, Bruno, you're over there too. Okay. You know, that goes back to that conversation we were having the other day about how when we assume somebody is in another country, we're like, oh, you can get there because you live in the same country without putting the uh, <laughs> distance displacement in. It's like people here, I live in Virginia, and they're like, oh, hey, you live in such and such, you can get there. And I'm like, yeah, it's a six and a half hour trip. And they're like, wait, your state's that big? And I'm like, yeah, I mean, some of the areas, depending on the back roads we got to take, yeah, I'm way up in the mountains. Yeah, but what's a four hour drive between friends? Eh, not much, I guess. Especially because I'm not going to be driving. I don't drive. I would just hire a taxi.
Opposite of England losing a bad drive. Ah, okay. Five hours to the next decent city for Morgan. Ooh, you're way out there. Takes you wow, Emmy. Sixteen hours to visit family. Yeah, you're you're almost at that point, I think, where it's better to just fly. <laughs> Which you probably do if it's a sixteen hour road trip. Or at least I hope you break that into a two day trip. Okay. I've been talking. We're trying to get all <laughs> I don't know. I may have to... I don't want to break the boss battle into two parts, but I feel like episode 15's dragged on a really long time. Uh, let me check something real quick, guys, and we'll determine... Maybe I'll just take a vote. I don't normally run my streams this long, but it is kind of a... I don't normally get a full room, either. <laughs> uh, let's see. Nothing else is going on right now. I'm not needed anywhere else, I don't think. Oh my gosh, Emmy, you guys just drive there and pass out? Good lord. That's that's such a drive. Like I can't, I can't even imagine sitting behind the wheel for 16 hours, much less being in a car as a passenger for 16 Oh, it's not critical. It's crucial. Crucial twins. I, well, I'm glad to have you on board, Crucial. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's a regular scheduled program that we're doing. So it's Tuesdays at 5 o'clock Eastern and Friday, 5 o'clock Eastern. Both of those days are dedicated towards the Front Mission storyline. Well, you're always more than welcome. I start every Tuesday and Friday at the exact same time, 5 o'clock. Oh, well, I'll have my VOD up. Yeah, I, I don't want to do this, guys, but I normally don't stream very long, so the battle's going to get cut in part. Um, what we'll do is I'll call Fridays 15.5. 15, uh, 15 and a half. And we'll spend the stream focusing the boss fight, and then we'll do a full upgrade after. And I'll do maybe, uh, we've got to build a few new mechs anyway, so we'll probably do some skill ups with the other pilots, and I'll let some people name some more mechs, because we didn't get to do a whole lot of that today. Let me get out of here and save this real quick so I don't forget. I've done that before. I've closed the stream and or thought I was closing the stream and I actually closed my game out without saving. No bueno. Yeah, 5 o'clock Eastern time, East Coast. I'm not sure what that would be on the other. Oh, no, thank you, Crucial Twins, for stopping by. I'm glad to find another Front Mission fan. <laughs> We stream a lot of content like that, by the way. If you look, I do World of Ships, World of Tanks. Um, hoping to do War Thunder at some point. All right, we got one save. I'm going to make sure there's another. And then we'll have to get some ideas for who to host. Oh, yeah. Tactics. We do tactics. All right, I'm going to put up the raid messages before we start looking. I don't know who we're going to raid yet, but I'm going to put them up because my OBS for some reason lags really bad when I start a raid. I don't know why. I have to look into that. And that's the one for subscribers and the one for non-subscribers. Okay, let me see who I'm raiding. Who do we want to host? Uh, oops, nope, not that button. I hit the wrong one because I wasn't up all the way. Scrolled up. Raid channel. Oh, I actually have a, I have a lot of people on playing games right now. Let's see. We've got Angry Barman. Uh, Play Me Out. 
it's got stuff going. Uh, you know what? I got a couple friends on playing games. I don't know where to go. All right. Do you guys want to be left off at Final Fantasy 7? Is that what he's playing? Yeah. Do you want to be left off at Final Fantasy 7? Do you want to see some Minecraft? Who else is on? Okay, that's it. There's your choices. <laughs> You've got Final Fantasy 7 or Minecraft. I don't really care. Either one would work. Or we can make new friends. I don't mind. I just like to help people. Somebody else is playing Front Mission 3? I, I will gladly... Um... <laughs> it's Tin Sarah. Raid myself. Oh, Thank you, Morgan. But I need someone to host. Final Fantasy 7 it is? Okay. Yeah, because nobody really redeemed the, the raid option. So let's... You know what? And I haven't raided Angry Barman for like... I think the last time I raided him was when I first got affiliate. So I, I owe him one because he came in here like two or three days ago. So let's go and visit Angry Barman. He's a really cool guy. And he is playing a classic, so it fits. Oh. Uh, Fruity, I keep forgetting to give you a list of commands that you can use that are that make things easier. He is not angry, actually. It's just a joke. He's actually very chill. So those of you who are new, that's my warning that I give when we're going to an 18 plus channel because my channel is work safe. Um, it's not 18 plus. We're PG-13. So channel we are going to is considered an 18 plus channel, typically for language, not for content. I have never seen him play anything that was really gruesome. He typically just plays the same kind of games I do, um, but they do allow adult language there. So if you are under the age of 18, I ask that you hit the leave button when the raid comes up. Because other words, you'll be breaking TOS. For everyone else, hopefully we can go over here and have fun. And everybody give, give Angry some love as he endeavors in another great classic final fantasy 7 okay so until next time guys um i will talk to everybody later oh i there were so many things going on today and i just forgot then i'm gonna hit the raid button okay it didn't come up oh if it did all right i was gonna say everybody's welcome to go to my discord all right we're off I think.